Good morning and good afternoon, everybody. It is Angie, Treasured Vintage. It's another Sunday already, and I'm coming to you with another haul and some friend mail. And I just got something just like 15 minutes ago on the porch. They rang the doorbell, and this came from eBay, and I think I know what it is, but we can open it together. So cool. Hey, Barb. Barb, good. Hi. Hey, Carla. Hope your head's feeling better today, Carla. I got up with a migraine this morning and I took my medicine, but for a while there, I was just feeling so loopy, more so than usual. Hey, April. How you doing? So, hey, Stephen, Steph. Hi, Donna. Hi, Debbie. Steph, how you doing? I'm going to finish up. I have one box left of the of your um, jewelry jar stuff, Steph. So I'm going to finish that up today. Hey, Neville, how are you? How's things down under? I think you're, I don't know. Are you in Australia or am I just crazy again? Hey, Francis. Okay, so I got this in the mail from Cindy. Um, Cindy loves jewelry. And it had her address on the envelope, but then inside it says a gift for Angie from going on grumpy. And yesterday I was like so surprised when I got it out of the mail and uh, this little heart box. So I was like, oh, and I had it almost open. I had it open and I was like, I wonder what it is. And I was like rolling it. And then I'm like, wait. Don't do it yet. Wait till you get on, on tomorrow and do it. Migraines are the worst. I know. What is it, Barb? What'd you send me? Is it? Okay, it's in a baggie. Ooh, it's cufflinks with cars on them. Thank you, Barb. They are pretty. I think I remember, I might have remember seeing these in the, in the haul that Cindy had. Oh, they're really cool. I love them. Thank you, Barb. They're white enamel and they're gold. The, the cars are gold with green on them. Those are so neat. I love them. Thank you, Barb. I love you. Barb is always thinking about other people. She's the greatest. She's the greatest friend. And all my other friends, too. Too. Excuse me. <laughs> and Cindy, thank you for doing that for Barb. If you're here and you watch later. Okay, so I want to see what's in here. I think I know what it is. I think I bought some necklaces, like a lot of necklaces. Hey, Sally. Sally made it. Get your listing done, Sally. Okay, so came out of the box just like this. With some bubble wrap in it. And it's got her card on it. Hmm, I don't have my um my tool back here. I'll just use my scissors to open the bag. Portrait of the South. Yay, necklaces. Pearl is here. Dawn's here. Dawn, are you going to work today? Yeah, that's what it is. It's all these necklaces. It's a bag and a bag of necklaces. Deb's here. Hi, Deb. Okay, everybody's saying hi to each other. Open up. Open up. My gosh. Woohoo! Okay, there was some in here that I particularly liked. I hope. <laughs> I hope there was. Barbarella. <laughs> Barbarella. I get it. I get it. That's what you're calling Barb, huh? Barbarella. Got to be of a certain age to know Barbarella, don't you? Ooh, this is pretty. Long. And it's in really nice shape. You can you can double it, and it has it has um, gold beads on it. Gold beads. 
Um, trying to think of what I paid for this lot. I can't, I don't think I paid, I can't remember. I can't remember. I bought so much stuff lately, I'll tell you. So I can't remember. Uh, no, these are gold, gold beads, actually. They're like brushed gold. Does it look like pearls? See them now? See them better now? So they're like Florentine finish or brushed gold tone beads. And uh, it's very, very long. Very long, like that long. So there's that. I love that. I think I have, there's one in here that I already have one of. Oh, this is not not real fan of, of tassels that are actual fabric. So I'm not, not sure about this one. Hey, David. Dave. Because your friends call you Dave. Hey, Dave. What's that? What's that? So this is a has white has has white shells on it like that, and then it has the uh, and then it has this fabric tassel on it with some filigree a filigree cap like that. You call him rock and roller. David Rock and Roller. Hello, South London reseller. Hey. <laughs> Why do you call him Rock and Roller? I like that, though. Oh, this is pretty. I didn't realize there was one that... I, did, I didn't see this in the picture that looked like this. I love it. Look at that cross with the, like, porcelain pink floral... Uh, Cabochon in the middle. Isn't that pretty? Oh, that's so pretty. It's not marked. I was like, that's nothing I've ever seen before. It's not Sarah Coventry. It's not one of her many crosses that she did. So that is really neat. Hey, Kelly. Love, love, love that. Stay still. Love it. So feminine, feminine, chunky, pretty. Yeah, the cross pendant. Yep, it is pretty. I like that. So two, two winners, two out of three, I think, so far. I love. Let's and this one. How do you too, Belinda? How are you, Belinda? There's a movie called Rock and Roll, and and anytime I see Steve lights up and has has to shout it out in an accent, <laughs> David figured it out and started writing it all the time to make Steve perform it. Oh, I want to see it. I want to see it too. Whenever next time we catch you live. I'm going to see that, too. This is pretty cute. Look how cute that is. Like that, too. We got the rose. Very intricate. It's, it's also a brushed, uh, brushed finish. See the rose, the gold rose. Chain. Dangles. Got lots going on. Medium long chain. Rope chain. That's the total length of it there. Pretty neat. So we got four. No, wait. One, two, three. Yeah, three that I really like. One that's, yeah. Three. It, so far, I mean, I'm, I already made my money back. I made way, way far of my money back. Hello, right back to you, David. You like that one, Neville. Hey, Nellie. Nellie's here. Nellie, I don't know if you've caught me live lately, Nellie. I missed you. I miss you when you were not here.
I miss you when you're not here, Nelly. Now let me figure out this combination. Let's see. Okay, it's hooked. It's going to be a nice multi-chain beaded necklace. That's very nice. The quality is nice. It's in nice condition. Cool. Love that. Very pretty statement necklace. See, I think it's backwards, though. I think it goes like this. Ooh. Luscious. I love me some necklaces that look like that. Look at the filigree beads. Something about those filigree beads just says vintage. Cool vintageness to me. I love those beaded, I mean, those filigree ball beads. You get sidetracked with life. Oh, that's okay. I know how that is. I do too. Life can sure do that. That's for sure. I got this on eBay, Francis. It just came today. And I did not know they delivered on Sunday. That was weird to me. And they, they rang my doorbell. Made the dogs bark, looked out there, and there was a package on the porch. Ow! Oh, an owl. He is cute. He's articulated. He's got glowing green eyes. His little body moves. See that? His body moves. He's in good shape. I don't see very minimal finish wear on him. Who? 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 Yeah, that's nice. I mean, I'm I'm not real big on the owls because you just see so many of them, but this one's nice. I love the green. I love those glowing green eyes, and I love that he's articulated. And and not like the usual ones. The usual ones are. Oh, I think there's one of the the other ones here. I'm not sure, but. There's a certain type of them that you see all the time, those owls. That would be cute from a rear view mirror. <laughs> yeah, as you drink your Starbucks. As your owls just dangling there and you're drinking your Starbucks, right? Angie, if I ever find any butterfly, if, if you ever find any butterfly brooches, let, let you know I'm collecting them. But I've had no luck. Oh, I've got some. I probably have... I don't know. I probably have five or six. There, I've got some gold tone ones. I have some enamel ones. I will shoot you a picture. I'll, I'll get them all together and shoot you a picture of them. So here's another owl. Ow. Ow. <laughs> and Jerry would Jerry would like it too. He'd see it. He'd see it swinging in the. In the mirror and he would like it too and now i bet he likes owls little jerry seinfeld look at that one that one's nice too this one's silver tone and uh well it looks like it's on a gold tone chain so i'm little i'm a little i don't know it's either on a yeah it's on a gold tone chain so maybe it's gold tone and just lost all its gold tone so this one is you know not as nice not as nice. Yeah, Princess Casserole has a lot of butterfly brooches too. Okay, I will. I'll let you see them. Oh, this was one I really liked. This was one. Oh, so cool. Okay, these are like faux Baroque pearls on a lariat. This this you can move up and down, right? This piece here. Oh, this was one of them that I loved. So it's not uh, signed or anything. There's no um, clasp or anything. But look at these. Can is my signal okay? Because I'm right back here beside the router. I hope you can see okay. Can you see these pearls? See those? 
isn't I, isn't this cool yeah between the three of us would have a constant collection who's the other person that has the um the butterflies okay who loves this as much as i do i love it i just i don't know i just love it i'm good okay good Love that. Oh, good. It's awesome, isn't it? That's, I'm glad. I'm glad other people are liking that, too. I love it. I'm good in Missouri. Okay. I'm glad this came today. This really adds to my um, haul. Oh, this is pretty nice, too. Gold and white chain. Be nice for summer just a golden white uh pretty lightweight it's enamel or is it plastic no it's enamel enamel links and gold tone links double links is the baroque one gold tone or silver tone it's gold tone no wait it's silver tone where is it yeah it's silver tone awesome awesome vintageness and just i love that's just that's just the kind of stuff you don't see today and it's the kind of stuff that i just love putting in my shop the kind of stuff i get excited about dawn does not have butterfly jewelry no not <laughs> That is a great chain, isn't it, Francis? Sally has butterfly necklaces, and you, the the best one is gone. That one, I wished I would have got that from you. That one with the brown um, lucite, and it was articulated. And oh, that was that was really a cool necklace, Sally. I can't tell you how cool that was. Well, you know how cool it was. You had it. This is cool. This is cool, red and white. Red and white, and it's in very, very good condition. You know how some of this white enamel stuff, oh, I do see a little bit of wear. Some of this white enamel stuff usually has metal wear on it, or enamel loss, and the metal shows through, but this one's pretty good. Really, it's pretty good. Can't get it straightened out right now, but you get the picture. You get the picture. It's cute. I don't want to mess with it too much and get <coughs> get the enamel off of it. <coughs> Excuse me, allergies. <coughs> allergies are terrible this year. <coughs> I never coughed as much as I did this year. You have a crap ton of jewelry that nobody would buy. Oh, I bet. I don't believe that. Sally's here. Yeah, she was here. Donna. She was up there somewhere in the chat. Bianca, hi. <coughs> I understand if you have to leave and get your nap, Bianca. Because you want to watch the... Six pack is the six pack on tonight though because of the the highway yard sale or whatever. Is that on tonight? This is cool too. Wow, I scored. I scored on this. I'll tell you what. I scored on these necklaces. Okay, this is long, it's gold tone. And it has, um, it has this dangle on it. Can you see that dangle with the gold tone and the 
faux, I don't know what the shape is, teardrop shaped or I don't know, but that is cute. That's got this, this thing here just hangs, hangs real nice. And then it's got two of them up here, one on each side. It's a double strand. Isn't that cute? I love that one too. Love it too. Yeah, I did, Kathleen. How are you, Kathleen? I opened it. It was a pair of cufflinks from Going On Grumpy. That's what it was. And they had cars on them. And she got them from Cindy Loves Jewelry. And then Cindy Loves Jewelry sent them to me from Barb. Wasn't that nice? Sally, I left a message in one of your videos explaining what one of the earrings was made from. Oh, that was nice, Donna. Hey, Linda Dunn. How are you? Oh, this is cute. This is another white and gold one. I'll tell you what, I need to get I need to get listing this afternoon. I have been sorely well, it's not my fault, really, but I've been busy, so I haven't been listing, and, man, I, I really need to get some fresh fresh listings up in my shop. I feel terrible that I haven't hardly listed a thing all week. Hey, our treasure trove. Can you see this one? It's white, white beaded, double strand. Gold tone with this ornate little dangle on it. Cute. ESP Etsy. What's that, Carla? Oh, especially. Gotcha. Sonia Stanley. Hi, Sonia. Thanks for coming, Sonia. Okay, this is just a chain, a double chain, uh, very simple chains. Pretty, pretty nice shape, nice condition, chunky, chunky chains, and um, got a nice mid-century clasp on it. Angie, where did you get this lot? I missed the beginning. I just got it today. Came on, came in on my uh, porch just a while ago. eBay. Uh, here is the. Here's the clasp, which is a very nice clasp. I like that clasp. You don't usually see those kind of clasps on this kind of necklace, but I guess it's probably an '80s necklace. It's nice, nice condition. Can't stay long. Okay, you're headed to your daughter's graduation. Oh, good. I hope the weather's okay and everything. Congratulations to your daughter. Pretty, how do you get motivated to list? I really need to list, list, list. I actually don't need any motivation at, the time, at this present time. I really want to list because I kind of miss it. I kind of feel really feel like listing today. Um, I haven't, like I said, I haven't listed all week, and I, I'm really anxious. I've got pictures taken, so I'm really anxious to get my get new stuff in the shop. Um, so I don't I don't have a problem right now, and I don't know how to get I don't know how to tell you to get motivated. I guess look at. Look at some some of your stuff and realize how much money you're going to get for it. <laughs> That's one thing. Raining cats and dogs. Oh, it, so it's going to be inside. My graduation was inside. Well, it started raining whenever it, we were outside and we all got wet. <laughs> I hear you. <laughs> I need somebody standing next to you with the hot poker. Well, we'll see. Maybe Jim Jimmy can do that. I'll ask him. Look at this long tassel. This is awesome, too. Oh, wow. This is cool. I didn't realize that tassel was that long. Wow. 
Sweet. Look at this. So am, is, am I the only fan of this? I love this. So you could double it or it's really, really long. Look how long it is. Woo. That is cool. Dawn, you called in sick? You got got bit by something on your ankle and your whole foot's swollen. You you could still go to work, but you don't want to. Ooh, Dawn, your whole foot's swollen. We'll keep an eye on that, okay? You don't want to get some kind of blood infection or something, right? Make sure you keep an eye on that. I don't blame you, Dawn. I'm glad you're home, Dawn. I'm glad you're here. You love that. It's a really pretty lot. Very pearl heavy. I love this one, too. I know. Okay, this one's pretty. Oh my gosh. I I am just blessed. I'll tell you, so blessed with this lot. Look how pretty this is. In very beautiful shape. Um it's just a plain Well, it's not really plain, but I mean it's there's no more chains to it. One chain, single chain, Florentine finish, etched, scrolled uh pendant very nice very nice pendant very pretty wow 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 that's gorgeous and to think i didn't used to like necklaces i used to like dread i still don't like taking pictures of them and because they're they're a little contrary to take pictures of i mean it's easier to take pictures of pins and rings and that but um hey uh, oh my here's another cute one the one what where did you put your foot <laughs> leave it up to barbarella to say that don where'd you put your foot you're trying to find more jewelry but i have never seen something like a jewelry jar here you have to find a piece by piece and find brooches the most and you find brooches the most i love necklaces this, this is cute look at this it's also long it's very simple it it's um white what if these beads are glass glass beads not plastic um felt like glass yeah i'm pretty sure they're glass and has a little filigree cap little um long stations of gold tone that that it hangs on and then there's the little beaded sections here and it's also pretty long that that's cool i love that one too wow i the picture for this lot was so so i mean i knew there was some cool things there but i am more than tickled with this stuff i'll tell you more than tickled very very happy hey weekend shopper hi nice to see you too okay now this is stuck a little bit there we go there we go okay this one is pretty similar to the other one that we were just looking at only it's smaller in in shape it's a smaller and shorter with this pendant here with some open work around the edge very nice i must say this this is a, a, a nice lot for um everything's in nice shape i mean mostly everything We ran, we run out of jars and bags around my area too. Hi Kathleen, sorry, cl cleaning behind on chat. Your doll head looks perfect next to doggy. <laughs> I know, that's Demetra. Demetra's back there. Demetra and, and uh, Goonie Pearl, they're already friends. They're good friends, aren't you guys? <laughs> Okay, and this is one of these classic 80s style 
enamel uh, middle area stations, whatever, with a nice curb length chain. Uh, it's nice. Very nice. This one I'm, you know, I can take or leave because I know there's a million of these kinds of uh, necklaces out there. And, and there's a million of them on Etsy. Not a million, but, you know, they're plentiful. Yeah, Carla, I hope your head's better today. And this one makes two uh, that I have just like this. It's a Sarah Coventry. I recognized it right away. So I have two of these. Now, I think one of them I got from April, friend mail. I think, I think this was in one of the ones you sent me, April. But um, it's very pretty, though. It is a pretty Coventry cross. Love it. So it's long, too. Nice long one. So that does it for the necklace lot. Yay. Thank you, Lord. I am very happy with that. Oh, I'm glad your I'm glad your head is better. Ooh, the doll head's Greek. Demetra. Yeah, um, Tanya named her. So she told me what her name was. Um, Dwayne got Clementine and I got Dem Demetra, which I think fits her. She looks like a Demetra to me. She's she's really cute. So now I have to get up because I didn't bring the other lot over here. But I'm going to finish up Steve and Steph's um, lot. Oh, I wanted to show this. Okay, the jewelry jar, or the, the lot that I was showing last week, I had a big tangle. Remember that tangle when I said, I'm going to have to get this out later? Well, I found another really, really cute um, necklace in it, too, and really long. And, and it's one of these double chain necklaces. Check out how long it is. And it's all connected here in the middle. Oh, no wonder it got all tangled because, I mean, it wants to tangle into itself. So that's cool, isn't it? It's one of those gold-plated leaf necklaces, and it's super long. I like it, too. And, uh... I mean, it's super long, super long. But I love that design. I don't even know what you would call that design. It's cool. And uh, here's the um, here's the clasp. It's like that. It's got a lobster claw clasp and a really long, I don't know why you'd need that extender. If you want the thing to run down to your knees, I guess you could use the extender. I mean, my gosh. Let me see how long it is. I'd get tangled up in it. I know. It is delicate. It's beautiful. Look how long. Okay, look how long. Dang. Oh, excuse my, my bottoms. I'm kind of in my loungewear because, well, it's Sunday. That's why. <laughs> And then, and I want to be comfortable, but I have to get up to go over here and get this box. Okay, I'm back. <clears throat> oh boy. So. Somebody messaged me and wanted to buy one of uh, a scarab necklace that I had. Well, I'll put it this way. I had. I, I'm looking all over for it. I know it's going to turn up. It's, it just didn't vanish into thin air. So I'm still on the search for that. It's here somewhere. But I have so much jewelry. I'm entitled. Oh, thanks, Weekend Chopper. <laughs> I did work pretty hard this week. Do y'all like this? This is kind of not jewelry, but I love it. And I, I think I'm just going to maybe keep it and use it. It's a vintage straw purse. I'm kind of scared to, 
to use it because the inside's really delicate. Dawn, do you might like this. And it looks like somebody sewed the inside. Right here. Looks like someone even sewed it. Because it's kind of like, um, it's almost like, I want to say, Dacron or one of those old sounding fabrics in there. Or, or I don't know. It's kind of like knit, but not knit. And it's by Wahlberg, I believe. Yeah, Wahlberg. Wahlberg. Wahlborg. But look at that cool pattern on there. That's a pretty cool pattern, isn't it? It's got the right the right uh, length of a shoulder strap on it. Strap's really good. The whole bag's really good, actually. And I'm like, maybe I'll just keep that. I had it listed for a long, long time. Nobody was interested in it. But it's just a good size. Smells like nothing, which is always good. Hi, Cheryl. You're on the road outside of Portland heading towards Seattle. You're not driving. Well, that's good. I'm glad to hear that. Don't drive. Muslin, kind of. Kind of, nah. Because it's it seems like it has nylon in it, though. Um, Push liner. Good idea, Francis. Um... Nice big clasp. Yeah, that it had a zipper too, but then it had that wooden thing that went over it. Okay. So this is a continuation of last week. Just put it that way. Um, guess what? A stretchy bracelet. But this is actually a nice one. It's heavy. Um, it's got real glass beads in it. Moon glow type of golden beads it's kind of pretty kind of pretty kind of tiger's eye -y or something so that's that's a nice one if you have to have a stretchy bracelet that that would be the kind to have so there's that it's like a cosmetic bag hmm is that like a pocket protector for a purse Gee, I don't know what you're talking about now, but that's okay. I think you're talking back and forth. Oh, I know what you're talking about, Nellie. Insert, an insert. Yeah, that'd be a good thing to use instead of, so, so that the liner wouldn't get messed up or rip and all that. Just put one of those inserts in it. I know what you're talking about now. That's a good idea. I have one of those. I do. Okay, this is another necklace. If I can get it there. Like that with circles. It's pretty. Textured circles. This must be the day of necklaces. Jewelry. Jewelry's on the six pack, huh? Every time I see a stretchy bracelet at the thrift store, I think about you. <laughs> Do you really? Well, you know what? I have I have actually salvaged some out of my hauls and said, this is not so bad. I'm going to wear it. I, I don't think I've worn any yet, though. <laughs> so these, like, these almost look like those Ed Hardy-type jewelry. You know, you know that Ed Hardy-type jewelry? I don't know. Just looks like that to me. Stay still. Good grief. A shell, kind of. And they have these roses on, and they're big. That's their shell. And then, Angie, how do you decide what price to take for your jewelry? I do research on, on the jewelry. The first thing I do is I look on Etsy to see, <coughs> excuse me, to see if there's anything like what I have, see what they're asking. Um, if there's nothing like that, um, then I think, well, 
you know, the market's pretty much mine then. Um, I'll try to find something comparable, but I know that eBay is not a good, uh, I look at eBay, but it's really not a good uh, place for comps as far as Etsy, because Etsy is a totally different market than eBay. Um, it says, now earrings I love the best and rings. Necklaces choke me and bracelets annoy me. <laughs> All righty then. Yeah, I love earrings the best too. They're my favorite, I must say. Um, I like to photograph them. I like to sell them. They sell well. Um, now, I don't know about these type. These probably are not going to be great sellers here. But we'll see. I never tried to sell any. Oh, yeah, I have tried to sell some like this, but not with... Not exactly like this, but like these these discs that are mother of pearl or whatever. I've tried to sell them and they, they haven't sold. So here is a uh oh here's a butterfly pin. Oh it's not a pin, it's a it's a it's a um hair clip or something or some kind of some kind of clip. I guess you could put it in your hair. You you could probably clip it onto your collar or something. And anyway, this is what it looks like. It's very jeweled, very jewelly looking. Blue and yellow and green. Tracy, Tracy, my friend is here. Hi, Tracy. This is a blingy ring, very blingy ring. It's the more modern, more modern ring. Hmm. Question, what sells for you during Q4? Necklaces, earrings, or brooches? Uh, everything. <laughs> uh, Q4 is pretty good. I mean, overall, I would say necklaces, I mean, um, Earrings probably sell the best for me, but you know what? I don't know. I, I, that's not a good thing to say because I list the most earrings. So they might sell the best for me because I list the most of them. I mean, I I have a lot. I have the most of anything that I have in my shop is earrings. So I sell the most earrings probably because I have the most of them. Um, but lately I've been selling a lot of necklaces. Um, here's two bracelets. Okay, here's here's a Winnie the Pooh watch, and it has like little bugs around it. Around it, I guess they go around. Maybe has anybody sold a Winnie the Pooh watch? See, I'm not real enamored with this kind of stuff. I do like it because it has the bugs on it, the little butterflies on it. It's it's in good shape and everything. I think this was in Stephen Steff's stuff. I think this is the rest of Stephen Steff's, as, as a matter of fact. You're welcome, uh, South London. Oh, it's bees. Oh, yeah, that would make sense, wouldn't it? Honey bees and, and uh, has anybody ever sold one of these? I don't know what they might go for, and this is not something. This is this will lay in my inventory forever, and I'll, I might never even list it. <laughs> that's how That's how excited I am about a Winnie the Pooh watch. <clears throat> There's nothing like super cool here. Sorry to say. Sorry to say. Um, this is a wooden bead necklace. Of course, you know, my super cool might not necessarily be your super cool. So I shouldn't really say that. Maybe you guys would look at this and say, wow, I love that. It's orange. It's orange and it's beaded and it's awesome. So, anyway, there's that. <laughs> there's that. Oh, I got a, a different kind of watch here, too. This, is, this was another watch that I probably won't ever sell. But I never, I never saw a Chevrolet watch before. This this watch says Chevrolet, and it's in super, super shape, super nice condition. Um, it looks brand new, and it's real pretty. 
I love I love the way it's made and everything. And I don't know where it came from. I mean, it was it a promotional item or what? But um, it says Chevrolet on it. So I like the design on it. It's you know polished and brushed, um, two tone finish. So I don't know what what will happen with that either. Here's a little owl owl stick pin. He sold several watches. It seems like people still wear watches. I always like to wear one myself. Oh, yeah. Bundle a lot of watches and get rid of them. Oh, okay. Yeah, I should do that. That's nice, Angie. I love silver. Probably a company promo. Yeah, it could be. Auction style, maybe just to make sure they disappear. That's a good idea, Steph. Here is a number one teacher necklace. Number one teacher necklace. There's that. <coughs> this I thought was kind of cute, really. It's a more modern necklace. <laughs> I'm never going to wear it. I never would wear it. But there was something about it I liked. I don't know. kind of made me hungry. It's like, I want some candy now. <laughs> I, I want some candy. <laughs> I don't know. Does it remind you of candy? Or, or am I just like craving sweets or something? Some cherries or something. There's a Chevy mall somewhere. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't start my auctions at 99 cents ever. Me too, Belinda. Out of the habit. You did great. It was nearly perfect. You didn't write all the beginnings in capital letters. Uh, I don't know what you guys are talking about. That reminds you of candy apples. Oh, yeah. Dark cherry. Yeah. Bye, everybody. Bye, Perla. You're headed to church. Oh, I love to hear that. Hope you have a great day, too. Have a nice time at church. Say a prayer for me. Thank you. Okay, this is... Uh... uh just a beaded, a beaded necklace, kind of hippie-like necklace, I guess. This is just a little black braided uh, bracelet with a little fold-over clasp on it. You know, typical, um, typical jewelry jar fair now is what we're getting into. Another bracelet. I think I showed you pretty much the good stuff last week. Here's a, another bracelet. Some earrings. They're kind of cute. This is kind of strange. This is a button pin. Pin. And then it's just like a. Like that on the back. Maybe you're supposed to wear it on your jean jacket or something. I don't know. Cheapy little zebra looking pin. I was speaking German to Bianca Angie as I have some family from there. And my mom is half Scottish and half German. Her mom was from Germany. Oh, I'm Germ I'm I have German in me too, I think. And I think maybe even Scottish too or something like that. I have a book that was written by my family. I should really read that sometime and see what I am. But I have like a, you know, a, what do you call it? Ancestry book that was written by some of my family. So would it would be nice to read sometime <laughs> if I really cared. <laughs> they make earrings like real candy bears. <laughs> These are nice. I like these. These are very pretty. They're hammered kind of uh, mixed metal looking. And I like the finish on them. They have the Omega backs. Omega backs. Pierced earrings. Nicely finished on the back. 
We like the pears. Oh, Angie, interesting. <laughs> yeah. The pearls. Oh, okay. You like the pearls. This is a pretty cute little necklace. I don't know. It looks it looks like it's on a very cheap chain, but I like that it's a butterfly. And the butterfly is like pretty colors of enamel and it's done on both sides. But the chain is real cheap. But I thought the butterfly was done nicely. I don't know. Well, I kind of like these these earrings. They're I don't know. I don't know what what the what the origin of them might have been, but they're kind of iridescent and they have these turtles on them and they're pieces of glass. And they're interesting. The turtles are like set into the glass, and the glass is like different colors. So they're cool. Turtles, turtle earrings. Seems like a lot of people have their roots in Germany. Hear that all the time. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, my maiden name is Cook, so isn't that German? Is that a German, German name, Cook? So, I think, maybe. Very cute. Here is a here's like a little patriotic bracelet. True, I'm German Irish. Yeah, I think I think I have Irish too. <laughs> I must have everything. I don't know. I have just lately started listing jewelry on Posh, Mark. Nothing has sold yet. It's only been a week, so we'll see. Well, yeah, a week's a little, you know, it's a little soon. I am not German at all. English, Irish, and Native American. That's a cool mix. That's a cool mix. This is cute, isn't it? It looks older to me, and it has these little, a bunch of little beaded, Red, white, and blue flowers, bead flowers like, be cute for like, um, be cute for like uh, 4th of July or something. Hello, my Kathy. How are you? My Kathy Quirky Girl's here. You just sold eight items so far in Posh. You need to do a video soon. Yes, eight items. Wow, that's great. That's great, Carla. You're just getting to be a veteran seller now, aren't you, Carla? And just to think how long it took you to get started. You had to keep keep trying to get you to get started and keep trying, telling you to get going and kicking you. And <laughs> Finally you started and now you love it. Here's some kind of Disney thing, I guess. A Disney necklace. And then I think there's another Disney necklace. Hey, Carolina. Carolina or Carolina? Probably Carolina. How are you? You're late? That's okay. Uh, I find wooden beads to be really popular. How would I contact you personally, Angie? I would love to send you some of my jewelry. Really, Tracy? I could make something in your birthstone for you. You're a Viking. Oh, Tracy. Oh, I'd be honored. Um, just look for me on Facebook. I have the same uh, picture on Facebook for my Facebook uh, profile as I do for um, my YouTube, and it's Angie Martin. So, or else you can send, I don't know if they let you send messages here now or not, but I'd love that. I'd love that so much. Thank you. So there's two little necklaces. Tracy's so nice. I'm glad you made it today, too. Okay, I like these. These are cool. These are nice, long, dangly, modern style earrings. They need a little cleaning, but they shine really nice and they're really uh, sleek. I use that. I've been using that term lately for. For earrings like this, 
like that are just like linear or you know just real real simple in their design i've been using that sleek term in my um keywords so i like those they're pretty really wooden beads i have a lot of those i do too let me show you i'll show you my collection that i have so far well this isn't all of them but see i'm collecting <laughs> i was gonna make a lot and I have all these. I have all these necklaces and earrings and all this wooden jewelry. So I keep saying, I'm going to make a lot. I'm going to make a lot. But I haven't yet. But that's kind of like a jewelry bag, right? A jewelry bag of wooden jewelry. I wonder if I'd put that on auction, what would happen. There's some cool things in here. I don't know about that. There's this one thing. I like this one. I like this. I think that's pretty neat. There's this one thing that just I don't know what to think of it. See, I, I don't. It's, it's something you're going to either love or you're going to hate. Where are you going to sell on Etsy? Where are you going to sell a lot, the lot? Etsy? I don't know. I, you know I only sell on Etsy. So... And I don't even know if I'd do the lot. You know, I, I just have a hard time doing lots. <laughs> uh, that's a bunch, isn't it? Look at this. I Is it cool or is it like, whoa, what the heck? This, this was something I got from Monica, I believe. I think it was in a lot. Oh, there it is. That goes like that. Somebody's either going to like that or they're going to go, well, that's hideous. That's the most hideous thing I've ever seen. <laughs> really really i'll take off in that plane my daughters are living too far away kathleen i have to get my coffee by myself oh you gotta go i'll see you later taking the kids to the fair oh boy it's raining it's it's pouring here is it raining in massachusetts or in new york it's raining here okay sally i'll talk to you later okay you think that will sell? Well, weird sells, doesn't it, Kathleen? So it probably will. It probably will sell. I don't even know where to start to describe that thing. But uh, it certainly is different, put it that way. I like this. Look at the pretty iridescence on this long necklace. It's kind of carnival, carnival glass bead, seed beaded. Well, it's really raining here. I can hear it. I'll tag you some cray cray airplane earring I bought Angie. <laughs> oh, do that. <laughs> do that. Do you want that necklace? Dawn, I'll send it to you. If, if you're buying cray cray airplane stuff, you can definitely have that cray cray necklace. Um, do you like this? This is like multi strand. Multi strand. Uh, Seed bead carnival glass necklace. Carnival beaded necklace. Fantasy island necklace. Good title. Oh, wow, Francis. That's brilliant. That's brilliant. I bet it will sell. It has a graffiti artsy look to it. Wow, good, good terms. I'm writing them down. <laughs> and Ness Dawn wants it. I mean, if she wants it, I will send it to her. Now I'll see this like next month written on this little piece of paper and I'll write, I'll read it. Graffiti artsy fantasy island. What the heck? <laughs> I'll go, what, what, what's that about? <laughs> it is pretty and I rarely, rarely wear necklaces. It would just sit. Oh, okay. This says, uh, Keep calm and carry on. And it's still got the tag on it. Somebody somebody made it, I guess. A little bead on the back. I think I'm at the hour mark, so I think I'm going to wrap this up. And I cannot believe I didn't even get through 
through the whole thing again. I did not get through the whole box again. But there's always next week, right? It's pro it's mostly stuff like this though. Mostly stuff that's Maybe I can do it in a hurry here. Don, God forbid. Really, really. really. <laughs> Don, hang it on the wall and enjoy it that way. Oh, that's a good idea. This is a, a cute necklace. This is a nice vintage, vintage piece. I love the design of this necklace. Although it does look like it's it needs a, a repair. And it has these, I figured out later, it has these earrings to go with it. Oh, it doesn't need a re I think the bracelet's with it. I think the bracelet's hooked in here with it. It's a choker, a bracelet, and and earrings, screw earrings to match. It's a whole set. Well, not a whole set. It's a demo. Demo Peru. But it's pretty cool. It's kind of nubby. Like that. But it's the necklace, the bracelet, and and screw back earrings, which I have them like hooked on the end. Hey, bye, David. Mr. T right there. <laughs> okay, here's a, I like this. This is pretty. I think this is, uh, this is Cookie Lee. Cookie Lee. It's cute. Shells or uh, shells and uh, yeah, like that nautical feeling. Wow, there is some kind of cool thing. Look at this big heart, it's a big old heart, acrylic pendant, giant. I'm kind of just going to show you a couple more things and then, that, then that'll be it. I mean, there's only a couple more things left in here, I think. Kind of like this. I don't know if it's a homemade piece or what, but this this piece kind of looked vintage to me. It's kind of like stone. And then it has a mother of pearl disc, and then it has this rhinestone, and that's what the back looks like. And it's kind of pretty. Then then you go up here, and there's this. This doesn't seem like it goes with it at all. And it's down here. So I don't, I'm not really liking that part of it. I would take that off and put a different, um, a different clasp on it. But the, the necklace itself is kind of pretty, except for that. I don't like that. The six pack show. <laughs> yeah, you guys got to go and rest up for that. These are pretty. I like these. I keep saying there, I'm getting done. I am. I don't want to be on for too long. You guys get so tired of me. I'm tired of me, so y'all y'all would be tired of me too. There's some uh, long dangle earrings. They're pretty. I like those. Pink fuchsia colored. Pretty nice shape. Silver tone. Some stretchy bracelets that have peace and that kind of sentiment on them. I like those. I would wear those. That's the kind of stretchy bracelets I would wear. Nice lightweight ones. See you, Deb. I'm getting ready to leave too. Bye, everybody. A bracelet with some charms on. Okay, that's it. That's it. I'm I'm gonna jet. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna jet. All right, not me. I Angie. I could look at jewelry all day. Oh, Kathleen, I do love shells. This is wonderful to see. Wonderful to see you too. And thank you so much for the offer about the jewelry. I'm excited. Um. All right, love you guys. I hope to see you next week. And uh, take care. Have a really blessed day. And I will see you soon. Bye.
Bye, people. Bye, my people. Love y'all. Bye-bye.